I don't have tea. I'm drinking coffee this morning. Hello. Draw my eyebrows down first before I get started. I already moisturized. Well, I already used my toner. My um, Peter Thomas Ross tightening eye cream. I already have that on. I just have to put my primer on. But I'm doing lipstick swatches. So this is going to be like a simple face. And got to be glue on my eyebrows. I tend to do that. I'm going to use our uh, Max new Studio Mattifying 12-hour control primer. I'm actually really obsessed with this primer, by the way. It's like just takes the oiliness away, hold it back. So I'm using um, Max Brow Styler in the color Spiked. Yes, I like this Brow Styler because it has a precision tip. And it is great for carving out your brow shape like this. I like the natural brow look myself, so I really honestly do not touch my um, the top of my eyebrows. I don't do that. So I'm drawing my eyebrow. I get my eyebrows threaded. They haven't been cleaned up in a while, but I try to clean them up myself. So basically what I'm doing is just Carving out the shape of my eyebrow, Henny. And then I like to kind of brush that line out a little bit. So all I'm doing right now is just that, basically. And I fill in any spaces. Just fill in any spaces that I see. That's it. That's all. I've been obsessed with using our uh, the MAC 24-Hour Studio Fix Smooth Wear Concealer in an NW shade. What is, is NW? Words. Is that NW30? 32? I've been obsessed with using this lately for under my eyebrows. Now, I just usually, I get the MAC 212 Flat Definer Brush. I know any concealer brush will work. And I just basically just take it off heel, stick that back in there. Let me see if I can do this like it's supposed to be done. And she's very smooth, very lightweight. I like it. I'm not going front. Like, this is one of my favorite concealers to date. I mean, I usually prefer a cream, but I really like this. I need to put my phone on silent and come in. So basically, I'm just carving out my eyebrow shape, y'all. Just perfecting the shape. It's a newer concealer. I used to use the NARS concealer, but no, I like this one better. It just sets beautifully. I washed, detangled and washed my hair and it's plaited up. So that's why I have the tur turban on. If y'all hear anything outside, they're doing construction. And then my puppy's over here eating his chew toy bone, not chew toy, his chew bone treat. He going ham. He going harder and he going harder in the paint. I'm using Peach Luster Color Corrector by Mac to color correct my eyes. I like this product. It's a lightweight. I'm using another sh different shade of Studio Fix foundation. I'm sorry, prime, uh, concealer. Studio Fix 24-hour concealer. I'm using this one in the shade. 
NW, I'm sorry, NC42. Mm -hmm. I heard you were looking for me. Hey. So, it's not going to be a foundation day. I'm only doing this because I want to do, y'all want to, I know y'all want to get to the lipstick swatches, so let me hurry up. Because the lipstick swatches is going to be, going to be what it is. I know y'all want to see the lipstick swatch, swatches, so I'm going to get to that as well, honey. Right now, she going to put on this NC42 and be great. So this is going to end up being like a no foundation type situation, y'all. Because you know you can achieve a look without using foundation all over. I'm just saying. Hello. Mm -hmm. Using MAC. Here's a contour palette. Medium, dark, dark. And I'm using this shade, please. Uh, I don't want to be rude. This shade. And because I have, I'm, I'm older, you're not going to see me really dump this on my face like that. I'm just basically setting it. Look at the faces I'm making. Huh. Let me know if this lighting is too dark. I don't want it to be too dark. But yeah, I'm here now. So now that I set that, per use Studio Fix Studio Fix Tech in the shade NC50. I actually use this shade for my contour. Teep, teep. Little fish face. Let me go ahead and some pro big. I always sweep up because up is up where it's just to lift the face, make it look snatched. Not, I don't want my contour too far down. See, and I'm swirling it up because I don't want my face to droop. And I'll go over it with a beauty blender anyway. So tap tap. And I'm doing it like this. Because it's so smooth and so creamy. Some people can use contour sticks, foundations, darker foundation sticks, whatever floats your boat. But this is what I'm using because I like it. You can see I'm buffing it out. And I will go over it with a beauty blender. Digging the scene, digging on you, digging on me, baby, baby, ooh. baby, baby, it's all I want to, I gotta be in love. Ooh, sha -na 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 -na. I'm gonna use the tip of it. Like that. And I am going to blend it out. Know that. Mm -hmm. Hello. I really want my nose to be snatched, y'all. I'm sorry. Um, so I'm definitely taking a beauty blender. 
Yes, please. Next time you come to Philadelphia, definitely hit me up, Pooh. Because I'll get the girls or all the way together over here. I really do. I just need to film more of me doing faces and take more photos. That's my downside. Over seven years at Mac, I don't even have a lot of pictures. That's weird. AF. It's weird. So weird. But yes, I will happily help in any way that I can. This is going to be a quick look, so don't think I'm going to sit up here and beat my eyes. These eyes is going to have some lashes, but it's going to be a quick look. So I can get to the lipsticks, because I'm excited about the lipsticks that I got from MAC. Ah, you're in the moment. Yes. I was caught up in the moment. And now I'm going to get my trusty M402. You can't even get this brush no more from Morphe, but I'm gonna use these two colors of my MAC palette I showed you earlier. I'm just gonna swirl, swirl, and I'm gonna set it, set my contour with my cream contour with my powder contour and I'm going to sweep up. You see how I'm doing that? Sweeping up. Because you want to snatch the face but you don't want to bring the contour down. You don't want to bring the contour down, honey. Set, 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 set. Sweep up. Now, some people do cut their contour and they clean it up and stuff. And I'll clean mine up too, but I'm going to do it in a different way that y'all probably haven't seen before, or maybe you have, mm -hmm. but I washed my hair um, and it's plaited, air drying, but this is what I'm using instead of a bonnet. So right now, pull it back a little bit, but she's giving what needs to be gave. Okay, now I know you're wondering how is she gonna do her nose? So with my nose, I'm gonna take the lighter color right here from the palette, boom, boom, boom. I'm gonna set, 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 set. Set, 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 set. Now I'm going to blend it. Blend it. Only because I like the lighter shade on my nose. I don't like a super hard contour on my nose. Unless it's like a theme. All right, and let me go and take the sponge back in this color right here, y'all. Kinda get this, get my life. anything coming on it it's too wet probably I'm just cleaning that up digging the stone digging on me digging on me baby 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 yes I'm thankful for people who are popping in today. Try not to look crazy on y'all. Because I'm doing everything with the, <laughs> the phone. As a matter of fact, let me look at my mirror and make sure she good. Dang it on me, baby, baby. So as y'all can see, I'm just cleaning up my contour a little bit. So it's not so drastic. Kind of blending it. It's hard to see, in my opinion, but. 
what it do. Oh, so I'm gonna sweep this product away. So yes, I swept that product away. Now I'm gonna take MAC it's mineral mineralized skin finish in the shade medium tan. That's my shade. And uh, it does oxidize a little bit. But how about I sweep it over my entire face so it looks like a blurring effect? <laughs> oh, I got a little bit on my bang bang. But I like that blurring effect that it seems to carry when I'm buffing everything out. I just act like everything to kind of be seamless to a certain degree. Mm -hmm. Let me take it like that. My mask is going to rub it off, but whatever. But this is me just taking my natural face color. I didn't use foundation because I can't find my backup one. So that was that. And Elf has this. I was given this by one of my friends a long time ago. But I really like this color. So I'm going to use that with this huh, special edition <laughs> MAC uh, makeup brush. That color. Boom, boom, boom. I'm just obsessed with the color. And besides the filters that I use, they be the same color, so don't be looking too far off. <laughs> so yes. I get me love that on my eyes. But I have this palette from Kat Von D. I hope she's not trending on anything racial. But I like this color, Noble. I like this color, Noble. I'm going to take, which brush is this? Oh, this is a Morphe brush. And I'm just going to tap it into, I think it's the Vita Loca palette. And just because it's a tan color, I like it. I like it like that. So I'm just going to put it on my brush all over. It's basically one big base color. And I'm just going to probably put a little saddle in the crease. Saddle by MAC in the crease. Just doing a little something, something, that's it. Because I've been heavy on my eyes lately. And I just want something that when I pick up my son from school and do my errands, I'm not going to be like, so looking like I'm going to an event. So yes, the 224, I love it. <laughs> yes, 224. And I'm gonna use some eyeliner top and bottom. I'm gonna go over, I'm gonna use engraved. This is my go-to liner for everything because once it dries, it sets. This is completely waterproof, baby. Yes, it is. So I'm going to tight line a little bit. Oh, I'm going up there anyway, so it don't really matter. But I guess I should start up there anyway. So this is what I'm doing, y'all. So I'm going to hurry up because this thing, once it dries, it sets. Um, I could use an eye coal, but I don't know where she at right now. And I'm just going to brush it out. Brush it out. Because I want it to look blended. Mm 
It's already starting to set. That's why they use eye coals for this, but I'm being a rebel right now. And you notice what my hooded eyelids, I always have to look down. I'm gonna do some saddle. I have to blow it out with saddle anyway. That's just part of what she do. That's just part of what she do. And I like the tight line, of course. She likes the tight line. Oh, don't turn out the lights. Don't turn out the lights, honey. But it's definitely going to work better with the eye cold, but guess what? I'm going to work fast and use this bad boy. Cause I like the, the willpower that it has. Basically what I'm doing is just making that black look more sultry, look more smoked alt, make a look more smoked on. So I'm using, just putting mascara on y'all. I didn't want to go into like so much detail with my eyes today. I just wanted to do like a smoky eye liner to join. Oh, as you can see, I already messed up, but it'll dry and I'll get back to it. All right now. So just a little bit of the whoop. And then but I'm gonna use Use my old tried and true Laura Geller gold, golden, is it golden honey? And I'm going to take uh, my MAC brush. It's a MAC 133. I've had it for a hot minute. It's like a tapered brush that I like to use for putting on highlighter. And I like her highlighter a lot. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that right on top. Of course, you know, I had to spray it with the Fix Buzz to get it to really pop. So I'm going to look down as I put my eyelash on. I just hope the mirror isn't in the way. But I've already cut these. The, by whip and the glue is still too effing wet. All right, let me see if she dry enough now. Because if it's too wet, that thing's rip and it be sliding around like a slip and slide. And I don't want that. I don't want it like a slip and slide record. So basically just laying her She's still a little wet than I would like, but the glue will dry and it's clear. So give her a little pinch just so that. Sometimes when the lashes get ultra old, I'll put some mascara. Oh, and I can't forget my Fix Plus. Sorry. <laughs> I do spray a lot of it, but I love it. All right, so now it's time for the lipsticks. Burm, burm, burm. So moisturizing. Oh, then it dries down and holds in that moisture, baby. Baby. No, I don't need that. <laughs> I was using stuff out of here. I used these lashes already, but I'm a back to Mac. Em. 
give them a shay. All right, so these are my lipsticks that I had got. These are all the lipsticks. All right, so Bitter Sweetie, Avant Garnet, Burnished Beige, Dusty Grape, On a Pedestal, <laughs> On a Pedestal. I'm trying to think which one, which color should I? Let me just open them up one by one and I'm going to swatch them on the back of my hand. The packaging is absolutely gorgeous. This is the dark one. Honey. I don't know what that was but the way these things are oh my gosh I love these look at that big car I'm flicked it y'all so please forgive me but look at that swatch here's this, another one On a pedestal and no I don't know them all by names yet this feels like an amplified cream yep it's amplified cream which means it's bold pigmented it's just really creamy the other one is matte Burnished beige. I'm gonna try to open it. I'm gonna open this one. Come on now. Let's get into it. I think I'm gonna buy the eyeshadow palette. Oh, this is oh, this is nude. I'm obsessed with this nude. It's a matte. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why my hands so slippery? You can't even see it. It matches my skin color. You can't even see it. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna try them on anyway, so. I thought that one was gonna, it's gonna hit, but nope, it's the same color as my skin. Yeah, that's the one I was on from the Gizate. This one is Bitter Sweetie, it's red. Ooh, big car. Yo, this is so weird. That's nice. And we don't have any reds this color at the store either. Tarnished reputation. Let me see what she is giving. So here's Tarnish Reputation. Beautiful. See that? Yes. I'm obsessed with all of these, period. And the last one is Avant Garnet. I don't know why I want to call it Avant Garde so bad. Is that a matte? The Tarnished Reputation? Yes, Tarnished Reputation is a matte. I think it's all matte, and I think two of them are Amplified Cream. Yeah, On a Pedestal is an ampl Amplified Cream. But the rest of them... Oh. So this one... So this one that we like, Sam, 
is an amplified cream. It's not a matte, baby, which is fine by me because my favorite one is cream cup and that one's a cream sheen and that's my favorite nude color. Let's see. I'm trying to get it in an angle where everybody can see. So there's a color for everybody. So you got more that's a red that's more pinky like, more deep, deeper. You have more classic, I guess. There's more, yes, this is definitely fall vibes. Definitely fall, fall collection. So two three and five yeah you said no reds <laughs> yeah two three and five yep 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 and i'm a um true package deco package wannabe queen so let me put on the nude first, because I know that one is going to be one I want to look at. On the wings of light. Yeah, so, I'm gonna so the one that me and Sam like is Burnished beige, burnished beige amplified cream. I'm gonna try that on. No lip liner. I know it's gonna wipe me out. It's gonna look like I got foundation. She's giving me life, honey. Is this cork? Just see something. Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. You can totally gloss her up. Light liner, dark liner. Okay. I'm definitely going to be doing looks with this big pair. I really like this color. 10 out of 10, even though it's an amplified cream. She still gets a 10 out of 10 from me. Thank you. I supported black owned businesses with these lashes. One of my coworkers, her name is Coco Couture on Instagram. I am Coco Couture and so. Right, pretty much. Yeah, yup. Yeah, nudes, I can get down with any formula. Absolutely.
I'm more attracted to those. Yeah, I don't limit myself to just matte for the nudes. Because I know nudes I can manipulate. This side don't look like I got a ring around the lip. <laughs> so I'm going to put on some Prep and Prime lip. Because my joints is dry right now. Gotta hydrate, boo. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Oh, Tropic Tonic. Tropic Tonic is definitely lighter. But I really like it. Yes, you can put Tropic Tonic in the center. Mm -hmm. I would definitely wear it just like this. Or you can definitely go in. You could do chestnut. Let me see how it look with chestnut. Let me see. I know I'm going out on a limb. She's giving what needs to be gave, honey. That's her with a little liner. I could totally. So yeah, this would. Matt Cosmetics. This one's called Tarnished Reputation. This is the swatch. You can use it without the liner. Yeah. She's pretty. Nice woman of color, friendly, fall orange. Not doing the most. Mm hmm. Yes, honey. 10 out of 10. <laughs> oh, so short, short, so short. Yes, so short. Yes. I don't even know how to pronounce that, obviously. Mm hmm. Yes, it would. So short, yes, honey. Oh, that color was nice. I'm telling you, they they Mac hit hit the mark this time with this fall collection. Mm-hmm. I did use chestnut liner that time. I used corked on um. Uh, the first one. But yeah, I'm obsessed with that color, boo. Period. But yes, social art is nice. So many people are afraid of that color because it's so bright, but 
can just add, like you said, liner to it. I had to add some more powder. Yes, honey. What's the next one we gonna do? I did the light ones, the lighter ones first on a pedestal. So on a pedestal is this one right here. I'm sorry. My angles is off. <laughs> My angles is off. Please forgive me, y'all. You don't? All right. Well, we'll we'll fix that. All right, so this one is on a pedal, pedal like the rose pedal, still. I'm gonna pedal still. Amplified cream. Very soft. Very juicy. Mm hmm. She cute. I will wear that with probably plum liner. I don't even know where plum liner is. I hope my child didn't get me for it. I hope I ain't get got. But this is a good one though. You can use this with any, I feel like any neutral. I don't know where the liner I wanna use for this at, but. Let me just put it on with my trusty cork. Because that's what the girls like. Mm. Look at her. Okay, I'm shook. Ooh la la. She's giving, I'm feminine. I'm rich. Don't play with me. Y'all could totally wear this. Just saying. And it don't even have to be a reason to wear. You could just put it on. Like, where you going? <laughs> yep, period. It's really cute. You know, you can always mat it down with a translucent powder. But I like it just like that. Ooh, we <laughs> to the stove. Ah, <laughs> no, that's right. On a pedestal, right? Just because you can. Just because you can, who gonna check you? I had just added cork, um, Sam. Mm -hmm. If you're doing a bridal, I can see that. Like if her wedding party has like that coral or blush, her bridesmaids. Okay, she gets a 10 out of 10. The girls get, give her a 10 out of 10. 
me see. All right, so that's the darkest one. I'll do that last. And these two. Oh, okay, so this one is lighter. So I'm gonna do the lighter red, and this is Bitter Sweetie. I wanna say Bitter Sweetie was the middle one. She's a matte. Royal Blue and Silver. <laughs> mm -hmm. the formula is great the color is great oh um, if y'all looking for a holiday red i mean the mat is soft like come on mac yes Oh, she's an amplified cream. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm glad I double checked. Is she creamy AF? This is definitely for definitely for the ladies who want a red. Now you could totally do something with the liner, kind of dress it up a little bit if you want. time and reasons I'll skip that part I'm definitely a fan of it her big purr those wipes are totally saturated and I'm here for it yeah dark purple liner mm-hmm And then I have another one over here. Oh, she's a true red. Come on, Red. Mm, 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 mm. Classic Red. Avant Garnet. Avant Garnet. Mm hmm. I have one more color. <laughs> then I'm done, done. I'm gonna get out of y'all hair. I appreciate y'all letting me step in. I know y'all think I be MIA half the time. And I do, and I do. <laughs> but I be trying to go through the motions with my life. All right, this last one is Dusty Grape Matte. I'm going to hurry up because I know y'all got to go.
Yes. Yes. And sometimes when you're quiet and still, God removes people from out of your life. We just need to be silent and listen. And that's basically what was happening. I was getting, I was silent and I was listening. I can't wait to show y'all the eyeshadow palette that comes with the, the set. I mean, comes with the collection. And the collection is called Tempting Fate. I keep remember, I keep Tempting, Tempting Fate collection. Perfect for fall. Like Mac really did it. Like I, I'm obsessed with the whole collection. You're working and watching. Oh yes, ma'am. <laughs> Nosa, hi. I use Prep and Prime Lip. It's um, it's still hydrating. It's different from lip conditioner. It's hydrating. It's a solid vitamin E product that you can put on. It, it, it's like double-sided tape. It'll seal in the hydration. And then when the lipstick dries down, especially matte, it'll keep your lip comfortable and it'll hold it longer and then you, it won't feather out. So we're gonna do Dusty Grape. Yep, Dusty Grape. And then I'll be done. <laughs> Hold on a second. I'm so used to using a lip liner. <laughs> Swatching did these lipsticks no justice, honey. These things. I'm telling you. I am telling you, these colors don't play with me. <laughs> I'm obsessed. I was trying to see if I can find a quick lip liner just to throw on, but. Looks like my ass is too unorganized. <laughs> Short. Mm. Vino real quick. Oh gosh, I never used that one. What the heck? I didn't know I had a brand new Vino. Yes, depending on. The lip liner. Mm -hmm. This is Vino. I love MAC liners because you can go over lipsticks with them. Okay. Okay, Shay. Thank you, Toya. 
Thank you. Thank you, Shay. This is a matte finish, Sam. Hold on. I'm going to tell you which ones are matte. Your name. Miko, don't start your crap. The girls can wear these. Sorry. Yes, the girls can wear these, honey. Mm -hmm. Pair it with the perfect liner. I like this with Vino. Because she's not too dark, not too light. Girl. Yes, the process. <laughs> I can't. So Dusty Grape, which is the one I'm wearing, that's a matte, okay? Avant Garde, Garnet was the red one. So. And Tarnished Reputation. So this one. So this one. This one and this one. These. Wait a minute. How many swatches I have? Oh, you can't even see. <laughs> it's my skin color. So these three are amplified cream. You can't even see it because it's my skin color. I can't. One, two, three. One, two, three. So these are wow yeah so the one me and sam like the most is the amplified cream but i'm a fan of all the colors that's why i bought them all because i did swatch them and i was like oh yeah they coming home with me and the packaging is cute i said oh yeah all right ladies well i'm gonna oh i don't have to get him that just yet but i'm gonna settle down and Get my life together. Take a couple selfies. Thank you, everyone. Kisses, smooches, everything. Be safe out there, right? All right, bye, y'all. Have a great day. Thank you. Period.